And now to the University of Michigan looking for a new hockey coach after the controversy surrounding Mel Pearson. U of M decided not to renew Pearson's contract, and here's what we know right now. An investigation revealed Pearson pressured student athletes to lie about COVID-19 contact tracing, and he allegedly fired a volunteer coach for raising concerns. Joining us now, Sports Director Brad Galley with more on this big shakeup, Brad. Ward Manuel, Michigan's athletic director, making it official. Mel Pearson is out as U of M's hockey coach after five seasons. Manuel making the decision after what he called a lengthy review of the program. This is on the heels of a third party review examining the climate and culture of Pearson's hockey program. Allegations against Pearson and the program became more public earlier this week when multiple news outlets obtained that 70 page report from Wilmer Hale Law Firm. Manuel had that report back in May. Allegations against the program and Pearson discriminating against female staff members. Director of Hockey Operations Rick Bancroft, who left in June, he was accused of acting out against women on the hockey staff. Another allegation in the report, Pearson advised players to lie on COVID-19 tracing forms before the 2021 NCAA tournament. And Pearson retaliated against goaltender Strauss Mann for raising concerns about that and the program's overall culture. Ultimately, Michigan had COVID issues that ended that 2021 run earlier that year. In a statement, Manuel said in part, our student athletes having a positive and meaningful experience is of paramount importance. Today's announcement reflects the seriousness with what we've heard and the values we hold dear at Michigan. Former U of M goalie Steve Shields was working as a volunteer assistant. He's the one who filed these complaints after he initially confronted Pearson. Shields said Pearson was aware Bancroft was bullying women during the investigation, the report said Pearson lied about having a conversation until the recording was made available. 63 years old, Pearson guided U of M to two Frozen Four appearances. His five-year contract expired in May. With this investigation's finding looming over the summer, Pearson was working as an at-will employee. Now the program will look for a new head coach. Glenda, Brian? Wow, a lot going on there. Uh, appreciate the update. Thanks, Brad. Disturbing allegations.